A very high-impact event settling in for Chicago and Milwaukee, much bigger than the last one, coming up on Friday and also into Saturday. And then, unlike the other storms that we've had, in which there have been many so far in the last seven days, uh, we will be followed by bitterly cold Arctic air. We do not expect to get above zero, zero Fahrenheit on Tuesday. It will stay below zero the entire day. That doesn't even count the wind chills. All right, so we're talking about snow that comes in uh, overnight tonight into Friday morning, maybe one to two inches per hour, even here into downtown Chicago where uh, we got a little snizzle overnight, but not much at all. It's actually above freezing now. Then we may actually change to rain a little bit uh, as the storm begins to develop. And then the next wave of snow comes up during the evening commute and gets heavier, maybe one to three inches per hour in terms of those snowfall rates. And then we get on the backside of it. Wind picks up 30, 35 miles an hour. The snow gets very light and blows and drifts around. And then by the time we get into Saturday, the temperatures start to plummet. It's almost going to look like a scene from the day after tomorrow here in Chicago. Chiberia, that's how they got their nickname. And we're not going above freezing. And I'm talking about zero Fahrenheit on Tuesday. The forecast high is minus one. Oh, get ready. Winter coming in with a vengeance here in the Windy City. Reporting from downtown Chicago, I'm meteorologist Jim Cantori.